Good morning and welcome to Community Unitarian Universalist Church. My name is Jeanette Bailey and I am one of your worship associates here at the church. And we are so grateful that you are being with us by video as we worship together. This church, like all Unitarian Universalist congregations, is founded on a common vision rather than a required creed. The belief that we all share is the conviction that every single person on earth has inherent worth and dignity and deserves to be treated with kindness. And the mission we share is to nourish spirits, work for justice, and transform lives. At Community Unitarian Universalist Church, all means all. We welcome your joy and your sorrows, your full personhood and your broken places, your curiosity and your fears and your seeking and finding and dreaming and knowing. As we gather during this time of the COVID-19 coronavirus, I'd like to say thank you to you for taking the time to join us online. Thank you to our Board of Trustees who made the decision to prioritize our community safety by closing the building and moving online during this time. To the many doctors, nurses, medical workers, scientists who have given so much of their time, effort, and love, especially right now. And finally, thank you to all of our neighbors and friends here and elsewhere who have shown in great ways and small that we are really, really good at this caring for one another stuff. Community UU Church of Plano will be closed until we have assurances from the healthcare community that it is safe to reopen. However, we are already scheming about how we can help one another stay connected. And if you have ideas or skills that could help, this is a great time to step up. Continue to check our website and Facebook for ways to stay connected, such as online meditation, story time for kids, a virtual coffee hour, and perhaps interactive adult religious education using Zoom, Facebook, or another platform. This week, the Women's Book Club Literary Ladies had an online meeting using Zoom. A buddy system, this is awesome, where CUUC, CUUC members and friends who are interested are paired up, agreeing to call or text to check in once a day with one another. The social interaction is so very important. Volunteer signups to help with basic tech support over the phone using meal or grocery deliveries or picking up prescriptions. Some folks are having trouble with that, etc. We have a couple of announcements today. Our church, as a community, has made two donations to local charities in order to support the needy during this time. We have made a donation of $500 to Meals on Wheels of Collin County, and we have made another donation of $500 to God's Pantry, which is an organization that we are paired up with frequently. But we want to support the good work that these organizations are doing at this time to help the most vulnerable in the community at large. Also, of course, since we are online now, doing, doing the offering and the collection during the service has changed very much. And for those of you who are here with us regularly, you know that we do a Share the Plate Sunday once each month. Well, this is our Share the Plate Sunday, and each time we do the Share the Plate Sunday, we have a different beneficiary. The beneficiary this month is our minister's discretionary fund, which is the benevolence fund of Community UU Church. This fund is crucial for supporting the people in our community who are facing financial hardship. You may not see 
on their faces that they're facing that. You may not know through hearing, through text messages or otherwise, that there are people in that position in our church community, but there are, and they need your help. So if you would please, on our website, communityuuchurch.org, go to the donation section. Please make a donation. You can indicate on the form that it's going to the minister's discretionary fund, or you can just put discretionary fund. That works as well. And that will help us with our share of the plate goals for the month of March. So thank you very much. Our speaker today is the one and only Kaya Hartwood, and Kaya has recorded her entire service from Austin, and we are so grateful to have Kaya back. Kaya, as a musician and a liturgist and an activist, is a woman who is making great things happen in the world every single week. And she is originally from Kentucky. She has numerous degrees. She has worked as a touring music musician with uh, her own band. Um, she heads an orchestra, the People's Orchestra, in Austin. And also, a couple of years ago, Kaya made a decision to become a minister as the wife of Meg Barnhouse, the senior pastor at First UU Austin, Kaya made the decision that she wanted to be ordained herself. So Kaya is just about to graduate from seminary, from the Star King uh, School for the ministry, and we are with her every step of the way. So Kaya is with us today to do uh, our service with music, with wonderful stories, and things to uplift us and feel connected together. So we know you're going to appreciate that a great deal. So we're going to go ahead and do our congregational covenant. All UU churches, as we've said, are non-creedal. And that sounds kind of fancy, but what it means is that we do not have to believe alike in order to love alike. So when you're interacting in a UU community, you are interacting with a people who have a variety of personal creeds, personal beliefs that they have regarding their spiritual identity. But there is one covenant that binds us together, and we recite it each time we gather, including when we are gathering virtually. And here is the covenant. Love is the spirit of this church, and service is its law. This is our great covenant. To gather in peace, to seek the truth in freedom, and to help one another. Thank you so much for worshiping with Community UU Church. <laughs> 